Hello everybody, welcome back to Triple V. My name is Susan and we got Mama Sue in the back as always. So today I got something different for you. Um, today I have a haul uh, that we got over the last weekend um, basically at estate sales, um, auctions, basically stuff that I couldn't record at. So I um, want to show you our haul here of some of the goodies that we got. So you know basically i'll show you these items um you know you can see them on our ebay store or maybe in an upcoming you know live sale that we may have if there's anything that you are interested in you can definitely email us too at vintage vagabondvens at gmail.com so i'm gonna get started here is the first little look at how cute that is so here we have a fenton art glass it is all hand painted um, it is satin as well. So it's a little white bear with pink pastel flowers, flower designs. Look at that, so stinking cute. And it is signed on the bottom as well, so it has the artist. It's a little Fenton art glass hand painted bear. So this one will be for $25. Just set that on the side. This one is going to be $38. Um, but here we have a vintage. This is Westmoreland Amberina. It is a hen on nest basket, and it does have the little handles as well. Very cute. And I think this one glows. Look at that. So you can see the little glow very cool very cute this one again will be $38 and be gentle with this stuff next up this one is a vintage Indian glass Indiana or oh, Indiana <laughs> <laughs> Indiana glass is it azure azure uh, blue diamond point vase or vase the very pretty so this one will be for $18 got some good items here guys next up here we have this is Fenton. It is a water lily green satin custard uranium glass. There's a little candy dish, lidded pedestal compote. Very pretty. You can see the little flowers on it. And I think this one has a glow to it too. Look at that. Who doesn't love the glow? So again, uh, this one will be for $30. Show me the glow. All right. This one's really cool. We got a little niggin' lady. This is Farber Brothers uh, Cambridge Art uh, Deco Amethyst Purple Glass. So chrome nude compote. You can see her behind. <laughs> Gotta show the behind. So this one for this lady will be $50. Very cool. Next one here is a vintage uh, Blanco lemon yellow ruffled top glass pitcher. Lemon yellow. Very cool. You can see the ruffled top. So this one will be for $28.
We have some more Blanco. This is vintage MCM. Mid-century modern. Mid modern. You can see it is hand blown. It's got the pinched ruffle at the top. It is a rose bowl. It's kind of like a bluish color. Very pretty cool. Pretty cool. <laughs> so this one uh, will be for $60. This little cute thing, this is a vintage 1972 Henzelka copper and enamel blue quartz sculpture. It does have the little wash pan and caddy. Caddy nine tail, I should say. <laughs> Caddy nine tail, right here. Very cute. That is pretty awesome. I love that. So this one will be for twenty-eight dollars. No, oh, this one has it's a little. Next one we're here, we have a vintage um, check glass. It is a flower bowl vase. And it has the gold trim. And you can see it has its little sticker there as well. Very cute flower bowl. So this one will be for $21. So how do you think we did so far with our little haul? All right, here is a vintage 1930s Laysmith black amethyst glass. It has little dancing snake nymphs and it is a little vase or vase as I like to call it, a little vase. You got the little dancing snake nymphs on it very cute here is the bottom and this one will be for twenty dollars this is a vintage <laughs> i'm so gonna mis mispronounce these uh check kralik pulled loop iridescent art glass vase Oh, that's awesome. Look at that. You can see the iridescence on it. Here's the inside. And this one will be for $65. Here we have some more Fenton white glass cat. It does have the cute little blue eyes and blue flower pattern all over it. And it is signed as well on the bottom. Here is the back. This one will be $35. And bottom again. So this one is either Fenton or Lee Smith, is it? It is flower and daisy pattern on it. I see that. F flower and button, I should say. Daisy and button. Daisy. Oh, God. It's that kind of day. <laughs> I'm like, flower? I'm, I know this. <laughs> daisy and button. It's iridescent. Um, and it has a little amberina as well. It is red carnival glass cute little shoe and this one will be for $16 so next one we have here is a heavy one <laughs> it is a vintage crystal ball you have the bubble sphere 
and it has the dolphin brass stand with it. So it's a dust stand and it does have the pads on it. And you can see it says made in Taiwan. You got the bubbles. And this one will be for $32. Debbie. So this one is hand painted by Debbie Cutshaw. It is a white satin glass Fenton Bell with the flowers and sugary finish. You can see it is hand signed in there. So this one will be for $14. Maybe I need that one. I don't know. All right, next up is an orca killer whale on a burlwood statue. That is really cool. Very cool. So this one will be for $18. Next, 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 we have, this is, oh, Mama Sue, signed vintage Orifors, Orifors, yeah. Brutalis Coronable, Brutalis, Brutalis, <laughs> <laughs> I'm still learning guys, so, Mama Sue is here to help me out. But it is or for Sweden, so it is assigned. It is vintage, four and a half inch diameter. It does have six panels with it as well. And it, again, it does have the original label. And it is signed on the bottom as well. Right down here, I don't know if you can see that. But this one will be for $18. Oh, I'm still learning. I'm getting there. This is one of my, I like this. This is <laughs> very stinking cute because this is what I want to do. Have some coffee in the top. <laughs> so this is a Hallmark shoe box. What does it say? Maxine, don't root a, rub a dub dub me the wrong way <laughs> don't rub a dub me the wrong way with my soap and you have the little signature on the back here as well <laughs> this is so stinking cute so this one will be for $25 don't root a beg me <laughs> rub a dub dub me the wrong way all right um hey price on that one All right, this one will be $12. So here we have a Fenton. This is another uh, Daisy and Buttons, smaller one. This is the yellow amber glass. There's that little slipper shoe. So this one will be for $12. All right, who doesn't love some little doggies? So here we have vintage House of Global Art Ceramic. You have the little Yorkshire dogs with the little puppy. It is, it does have a marking on the bottom, D152A, Japan. Uh, these are going to be $14 for these little Yorkshire doggies. So stinking cute. All right, what do we got next here? 
out of our haul. So this one is going to be $24 for this Ventual, Ventual, Vintage, how do you pronounce that? Corday, Cordy, Cordy, what? Cordy, Bust Woman with, she's got little ringlets, ringlet curls. Very cute. And this one will be for $24 for this vintage busted lady. <laughs> she's not busted. She's just she's a busty. Bust. No, a bust. A bust. <laughs> she's <laughs> I know. I got to keep it funny. She's got a bust. I do. I just had to be funny about it. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> all right, because I always mispronounce the words, so mm -hmm. here we have Gorham, Gorm, Garden Serenade Round Covered <sighs> Butter Dome, and it's got a little butterfly, and it is made in Germany. Got the butter dome. This is so cute. And I have a little sticker as well. I'd like to put my butter in there. And this one will be $26. You just can't have my butter. Alrighty. So, yeah, this we're going to clean this up, but this is a reverse painted lucite, clear lucite, I should say, um, sculpture. It has a little child clown with a little teddy bear, and they're in a, like a little boat. It's got little kite birds in there. Kite you have birds. Kite birds. <laughs> <laughs> it's got little birds. And a kite. And a well, that's a flag. But Oh. Looks like a flag to me. Yeah, I guess. Unless you turn it that way and the strings oh, okay. that way. It's a little flag. <laughs> yeah, All right. It is reverse lucite though. So very cool. Um, <laughs> this one will be for eighteen dollars. Oh, Mama Sue, you're killing me here. Hey, if I had to give some of this stuff names, I'd give it some easier names. <laughs> so, like this. Uh, Ramsing. Ram Ramsing. Vebeki. <laughs> Vebeki Yuki. <laughs> Ramsing. So or Dutch. And this is Dutch. Yeah, so I, can't I can't speak it. Dutch. Dutch. <laughs> Karamsing. It is Ceramic Studio, <laughs> Karamsic Atelier, <laughs> Vintage Danish Blue Speckle Glass Egg Cup Set. Why can't you? That would just be easier. <laughs> Dutch Egg Cup Set. <laughs> Eventually, I will find how to say these correctly, but these will be for $16 for these. <laughs> Next. Hope you guys are enjoying this. Getting a little giggle because it is what it is. <laughs> vintage. This is a vintage mid century Jason rotating wood weather station. Very cool. It is a barometer and it has the rain gauge hygrometer hygrometer Hygro hygrometer <laughs> I'm saying it right <laughs> hygrometer or is it no it's hygrometer so you have the hygrometer the regular temperature and it's got Jason on it but this is very cool vintage mid-century and this one will be for $22 for this little rotating wooden weather stand. 
See, wasn't that easier? <laughs> Rotating weather stand, wood. <laughs> All right, so this is the last from our haul. Yep. So the last one we got here is a vintage Corsidan green pottery mug. I know I said it wrong, didn't I? RX gallon. Shearing pharmacy cup, mortar and pestle right mortar pestle <laughs> this one is going to be $24 so you have the little RX on it so it's a little pharmacy cup very cool green the handles like the mortar yep the little mortar and pestle nope. <laughs> mortar and pestle <laughs> oh, mama Sue's doing it to me today so yes very cool looking. So this one will be for $24. So that is it out of our haul from this last weekend. I hope you all enjoyed the glow. Um, hope to see you all next time with my glow. And, you know, don't forget to comment below. Again, if there's anything you guys see that you're interested, email us vintagevagabondvens at gmail.com. If not, you'll see it probably on one, one of those items on, or some of the items on our, one of our upcoming live sales or on our eBay store. So don't forget to comment below. Hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you haven't to get some laughs at me as I learn. And again, thank you all for watching and I hope to see y'all next time. Have a great day.